Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Animotion. Today I'm gonna show you how to do writing in text animation and this lesson is gonna be my first typography um, lesson collection. Okay, now the first thing you wanna do is to go to uh, this type tool or you can also um, hit Ctrl and T on your keyboard and then just click on your screen in whatever you want I'm just gonna type in right in and of course you can select your um, font um, but I'm just gonna stick to a cursive font I'm gonna choose a freehand and as per usual you you want to make your object centered you don't have to do this but I like to do it and yeah by uh, to do that you can just go under a line so now you want to go to effects and presets and if you can't find effects and presets in your window you can always go to window and select effects and preset and so under that type in stroke and just click and drag that onto your text and before we muck around with the settings here let's just create a mask on your text and this mask is basically what gonna make your text um, animate or writing in. And to do that, go to your pen tool over here, or you can click J on your keyboard, and basically just create a mask on top of the text. I'm just gonna fast forward this. So the mask doesn't have to be exactly the same as the text, it's just like a guide um, for the animation. So it's basically like a path where the animation is going to go. Okay, now that I'm finished with all the masking, um, so under the stroke effect, you want to um, tick on all mask and then stroke sequentially, it's up to you. Stroke sequentially just means that the mask that you have, they will um, animate in one after the other. But if you untick that, um, the mask will animate in all together. But I obviously like um, to do the strokes you can show you. Now if you zoom into your text, you, you notice that there's like uh, white lines, that's basically your mask and that's just the color of the mask so you can always change it to for example red to make it clearer maybe or maybe for my case just like yeah, just probably blue, blue would be best for my case, just because of um, the color of, that I have. Now, um, I usually just go brush hardness to 100, but you don't have to. And so brush size, basically you want to make the brush size um, uh, high enough so that it covers the whole text, but also not too high so if you can just make your brush size as low as you can but at the same time it has to cover all of the um, the text and you can always like adjust um, the mask I just do probably 21.5. Alright, now that um, after you made sure that all of your text is covered by the mask, um, let's go activate the start keyframe and just turn your end to zero. You see how when you animate that, when you change that, 
the master sunny meeting in so just set the end to zero and if you click on your layer and hit U on your keyboard just to um, show your keyframe and I want to make the animation to last for two seconds so activate another keyframe here make the start a hundred percent so if you play that now you see the mask is animating in but how do we actually animate the text so basically it's really easy just change it change the paint style to reveal original so if you play it again now your text is animating in it's right again but if you see and play this one by one I mean frame by frame I see some error does anyone know what the error is? there you go you see how even before the E is writing in it already has that thing that's basically because if you go back to on original image that's because the mask on the T goes over the E and this is why we want to make sure that um, the brush is as slow as it can be but in this case I'm just gonna move that mask away and just find a way that it still covers the T but doesn't overlap with the E alright let's watch it again I think it looks much better now Cool, and I'm gonna select all the keyframes and hit F9 on my keyboard um, to make it easy ace. If you play that again, it just kind of make it uh, start slow and then it's ramping up and then it um, finishes slow again. Just kind of like smooth it out, the animation. There you go, you have your text writing in now. Thanks so much guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed it and please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and um, I'll see you at the next lesson.